Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon playthrough. Last time we started the Treacherous Mansion, we finally caught, captured the Polter Pup, so he will not be giving us any troubles anymore. And uh, we're going to continue on with uh, E number two, Double Trouble. I assigned a toad assistant to take care of the valuable exhibits in the Treacherous Mansion. Let's find him. He might know a thing or two about the Dark Moon piece. Oh, that's no good. That's not good at all. The paranormal readings in the Treasure's Mansion are getting stronger. With the periscope going bonkers like this, there's no way it'll be able to find the Dark Moon piece. I'm also worried about the safety of my Tota system. See, the mansion contains exhibits full of artifacts from all over Evershade Valley and beyond. They're very valuable, so I sent a toad curator to look after them. But looking at these readings, I reckon he may be in a hostile work environment. We need to help him. Besides, he might know where the ghosts are hiding in the Dark Moon piece. Okay, don't drop the front door key this time, youngster. Off you go. I didn't drop it the for well, I guess I did kind of drop it, but like... A dog was involved, uh, there wasn't a whole lot I could do, so it's... You know, it is what it is. <laughs> It is what it is. Okay, so... Now we're actually going to go inside uh, the mansion. Before we do, though, let me check the front yard here. I'm not going to go back down. Honestly, if you go back down to the like basement, there might be a way you can interact with that... Uh, um, that one flower in the dungeon. And maybe that has a lot of gold. I mean, there, there does seem to be a lot of, like, instances of that where, you know, if you want to find extra treasure, you have to kind of go the extra mile to find things. Which I'm probably not going to worry too much about, personally. I just want to check a few things here and there just to see. Maybe we can do something, but... I think we're good. Okay. Let's go in the mansion. Now you're probably noticing on the map in this first room, there's a lot of those uh, weird little portal icons. Hmm. And that's kind of uh, where the quote-unquote hmm. annoyance of this mansion will start to come into play. But uh, we'll start talking about that when we get to that point. Oh god. Oh. Luigi. You almost missed you missed him. Uh okay, well. Like I said, we have some of these portal doors, but they are currently inactive, so we can't do anything with them yet. Gargoyles also seem pretty motionless. What do we got in here? Lots of crows. Don't see anything else though. That's eventually where we're gonna get to, I can imagine. Okay. <laughs> I just thought maybe he had something to say. <laughs> that's all, that's all. Okay, hold on just a second, because there's something... Huh? Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought there was something you had to interact with in this first room. I had to get the chain to appear. Ooh, hello. Ugh. Okay. 
Kind of a kind of a small mini boss fight, I apparently, but <laughs> that's how we get the first gem. So hooray for that. Let's go ahead and move forward, shall we? So basically, we can go left and right here. I don't think we have to find like any keys or anything like that, which is which is kind of nice. We can just kind of get moving from the get go. Um, I believe you can also roll this up. I don't know if that necessarily gets anything, but never hurts to check. And this will put us in the Dark Age exhibits. So like uh, like Gad was saying, yeah, this is just kind of like a museum of sorts. So we're doing a Night at the Museum starring Vince, no, I mean, I mean Luigi Stiller. <laughs> What's in here? Oh, it's a ghost. How did I not expect that? Once again, for these blue ghosts. Okay, good. Let's do like a half pull, and then do a full pull. That's the way you want to do these. But as you can see, using the dark light on that ghost uh, prompted me to uh, stop him from his full man animation a little earlier. So that's again one thing you can kind of do to kind of make capturing some ghosts a little faster. There we go, we've opened the Dark Age, I think. And we get a book. You love a good book. That'll open the portal. So now we can actually get back to the first room. And more than that, not only can we get back to the first room, we can also take objects from one room to another room. So I'm not going to do that yet, but uh, again, that's one thing you can do as you're going through the, uh, this mission is you'll be basically open all these portals. And those portals will allow you to access other parts of the mansion while bringing certain items along with you. Some would probably consider that like maybe a little convoluted uh, puzzle solving at times. And I can understand that. I can understand that because there's just a lot of stuff you have to take into consideration. But, you know, a large part of this game is just experimenting with the environment around you. Seeing if you can find treasure and stuff. And that's basically what it is. So I honestly can't complain too much. And I think this game, for the most part, does a pretty good job of like all the different little explorey things you can do. It's very mean that they threw that cart at me. So we're not going to go inside this room just yet. Let's see what's over here first. This door is fake. There's no door icon on the map, so... That's a fake door we're not going to fall for. If we do, we only have ourselves to blame. We are going to check out the kitchen. No! Oh my god! Do you like flaming chicken? No. <laughs> He's allergic. <laughs> Fair enough. I feel bad, but <laughs> you try to take a bite out of us first, so I guess that's a good enough reason. Ooh, a fridge. Every kitchen needs a fridge. It's a mini game. Okay. No! That's actually a pretty hard minigame because of the ice you have to kind of navigate around. 
But um, I will say you don't get any gems for that, so it's not a big deal if you mess that up. So we're not going to worry about that, but I did want to show it off at the very least. That's pretty much all we can do in the kitchen. I don't think there's anything else we can interact with. If there is, then again, it'll just be for some treasure or something, so nothing major. Let's go inside here and see the next room we have. We have the Ice Age exhibits. And here we have another portal, so now we can access the main part of the mansion again, which is nice. Um, I don't think there's anything else we can really do in here right now. I think that's just another example of, uh, later on we'll have to come back here. But, uh, let's take a look and see what we got in here. It's a toad painting. That's gotta be his assistant he was talking about, the curator. So we'll have to, uh rescue him at some point. For now, though, let's do this. Okay. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> so we're in a different part of the mansion. We're on the gargoyle roof. So here we have a little minigame we can play. Thankfully, we're not timed on this one like the uh, other minigames. We basically got to make this uh, star exhibit. Uh, before I do anything else, is there any other gargoyles around? Is. Gotta do that. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. That's not even the star gem. <laughs> Come on, game. <laughs> Not even the star gem. That was like the perfect setup for that too, but they didn't even go with it. <laughs> very disappointed. Very, very disappointed. Okay, well, we're going to go back through the ma mansion. Taking our nice little shortcut we have here. We'll just make things a lot easier. And now we're going to explore the right side of the mansion. I think I missed one of them, but that's okay. Let's see if I can maybe put that back straight or something, but it isn't, doesn't work. Okay, anything with you? I'm, I'm really disappointed that I didn't like find anything there. Oh well. Uh, so in here we have the jungle exhibit. It's a rumble in the jungle. With not a Donkey Kong to be found. He should be here. <laughs> okay, cool. I actually got him before he attacked with the spear. I think there's another enemy with a spear, though! I'm gonna try using the dark. No! Rude. Damn it. So yeah, as you can see, like I kinda stunned him with the dark light there. Just again, another way you can um stun those guys without having to deal with them too much. 
Okay, so we need to jump down here. One, to get the health, but two, this is actually where the portal is, so we're going to activate that really quick. There's also pieces of wood down here. And some flowers. But there's also another toad painting here. And Egad only mentioned one curator here, not two. Very curious. Very curious indeed. Well, we'll find out later. <laughs> we got things to do. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to the Grand East. The Grand East is the best kind of East. Because it's so, you know, grand. Ah. So that's what the sand is hiding from us. Money. <laughs> okay, so as you can see, there is a fake door right here. I'll go ahead and activate it. But uh, here we actually have some bathrooms. Oh. Ugh. Sorry, I don't care about your stock options. You're a ghost. <laughs> okay. So notice how, um... Yeah, we got the safe right here, but the safe is not doing anything. Uh, that is because it's treating this one room, or these two rooms as one room. So there's still some ghosties in here we gotta deal with. At least I think there is anyway. Oh, come on! Rude. There we go. So yeah, we got the gem. We cleared that room. Let us continue to do this. Let's see what's in here. Just the money. I expected such, but still. Never hurts to check. Actually, hold on. Go back in. Is this a painting we can interact with? No. Okay. I could barely tell because, like, that vent is kind of blocking it a little bit, so... Just figured I would check before I did anything. Uh, so here we have the last exhibit of the uh, first floor, the ancient exhibits. It's so ancient. It's so very ancient. We can't do anything though. So, I guess one thing we could do, just to be fun, let's shine on the eyes and we're sinking! It's sinking sand. Oh god, are we gonna have to deal with freaking mummies again? Honestly, mummies are very annoying in this game. There it is. Hey, 
I wonder what we're dealing with. <laughs> At least they're not re-deads from Zelda. Or Gibdos, rather. Okay, so... Oh, God. Oh, okay. So the fire actually helped out a little bit. I'm trying to... Okay, I can do that. Wow, oh man. So much treasure. Ooh, Luigi's rich. <laughs> Luigi is very happy about that. <laughs> very happy. Okay, well, now that we're done with that, we can uh, finally start going back and backtracking and doing all the things we need to do. Um, I'm trying to remember, like, we got that, we got that, we got that. I think there's only, uh... No, there's still two more gems we can get. Wait, no, no, there's one. There's only one more. Okay. Well, we're about done. Uh, so we need to start, uh... We need to start doing some of the little side quests here where, like I kind of mentioned before, we're kind of going to be taking objects from one room moving it to another room and just kind of going back and forth. So first up we need to get the bucket from the Dark Age and we're going to take the bucket into the jungle. As you do from time to time. We're going to fill this up with water. Uh, we don't need to do this part, but I'm going to do it just because. Actually, yeah, I'll go ahead and do this now. So we have this little uh, spiky thing which we can use on this guy. It'll cause that guy to faint and that'll allow us to get the toad. Um, I don't know if I want to get the toad yet though. Not yet. Okay, we're not going to get the toad yet. We're gonna do this one thing first. But now we're gonna take the water. And we're gonna take this water to the ancient exhibits. Don't worry, you're not on a time limit or anything. Like, the water won't all fall out after a while. As long as you don't, like, throw the bucket or something, which. Why would you do that? <laughs> so we're going to take the bucket all the way up here to this thing. We're going to sprinkle it on that flower. This will give us a gem. So that was actually, I think, four gems we got in this area. Because, yeah, we had three. And, yeah, we got four, so, yeah, we're at seven. Actually, we don't need the bucket anymore. <laughs> we can throw that away. Okay, next thing we're going to do... Um, we need to actually go back to the jungle exhibit for two reasons. We're going to get a log. Or a wood chunk, whatever you want to call it. Uh, we're going to also rescue this toad. Gasp, finally, fresh air. Oh, Luigi, boy, am I glad to see you. It was terrible. Boos were chasing me all over the place. And that laughter, that horrible laughter. Anyway, thanks for rescuing me. My friend got captured, too. We've got to save him. Huh? The professor didn't tell you there were two of us? That old coot, he always thinks we're the same person. I wonder if he's colorblind. <laughs> Luigi, let's go save my friend. Before I fainted, I overheard the boos saying their boss finished trapping him inside of a painting. Then they men muttered something about the Ice Age exhibit. 
Okay, well, we know about him, so let's, uh... Put everything down here. I'm sorry I had to throw you, but there's no other way to get you down. <laughs> That's kind of the way it is. Uh, so I believe we also need to go to the ancient exhibit really quick, too. Because we need to light this on fire. And then we need to go back to the Ice Age exhibits. And again, that's pretty much what this mansion is. It's just backtracking from one exhibit to the next. And we melt the ice. We melt the more ice. Because that's what you do, you melt ice. I don't know what that was. Ooh, hello. No. Toad, I'm trying to work. <laughs> I'm trying to do things. And here's the other Toad. Yay, we got two toads. Oh. Hello. Hey, young feller. How, how's it going there? There. I haven't been checking in on the you because I've been nap... Er, looking for the Dark Moon piece, of course. Ah, uh, anywho, have you found that blasted toad yet? Once you do, send them through the pixelator screen in the inner courtyard. I think you mean two of them. Uh-oh. Nice. Man, we have a lot of gold, but again, I'm we're probably not even going to Probably not even gonna get the triple star rank or whatever. I'm um, actually we don't need to we don't need to go through the portal. We can just walk there now. Come on. <laughs> you got stuck in the corner. Come on. <laughs> Courtyard. Oh. Hello. Hey there, Sonny. Have you reached the <sighs> inner courtyard yet? The pixelator screen is above it, so you need to find a way to get there. Huh? Well, I know how we're gonna get there. A boo? Boopa Troopa reporting for duty. The boo armies are here, so you might as well surrender. I'm good. I don't need to surrender. Oh no! Okay, hold on. 
Oh, two of them. <laughs> now let's get rid of this ghost. Really? He has one health left. <laughs> okay, we got him. Okay, so we gotta do this again, I'm guessing. How did they suppress that staircase like that? <laughs> Video game logic. Video game logic! Come on, Toads. This video is already over 30 minutes. <laughs> huh. yeah. Here you go. Bye bye. Oh. Luigi, I guess I wasn't paying attention to what was going on up there. When two toads showed up here instead of just one, I panicked. I thought a ghost had managed to sneak in with the toads, so I walloped him and... Oh, jeez! <laughs> oh, silly me. He'll heal up eventually. Anywho, let me bring you back. Egad is just a terrible person. I've... I think I've grown to accept that. He's just a terrible, terrible person. Oh, I was really hoping for that to be a three-star, but... Maybe, maybe if we didn't get hit as much as we did, it could have been, but... Oh well, we did our best. I don't remember finding any gold greenies either, so maybe there was a gold greenie we could have gotten. That's probably the chances if I ever miss a three star. That's probably what it is. Is I just didn't get all the gold greenies or something. I knew I could count on you, kiddo. You're just so dependable. Clumsy and sluggish, but dependable. But I'm the one to talk. I totally forgot there were two toads in the treasure mansion. I'm always so busy thinking about my research that I forget minor details. It just seems like you're a terrible person, honestly. <laughs> okay, so we get some gems. Boo boo. Okay, no new spectral masses or anything. And uh, there we go. I'm glad that the toad curators are safe and sound. Although I suppose this means I'll have to give them their paychecks now. Yeah! And they deserve a huge raise, I think, as well, because you're so negligent. Anywho, when I asked those two about the Dark Moon piece, they had no idea what I was talking about. But they did mention that there's been a lot of action on the second floor of the Treacherous Mansion. And they brought a security image with them. I wonder what secrets it will reveal. Well, we're going to look at that next time and uh, do the next mission. We may not even do the whole mission in the next video because it's a pretty long one. Um, but yeah, I'll uh, see you guys then. This has been Slim Kirby. Talk to you guys next time. Later, folks.